I think we have to appreciate the the grand nature of desire. In the ancient Kabbalistic teachings, they say that in our reality, in our universe, there's only two things. There is what we call the light of the Creator, more clearly defined as a desire to share or to bestow goodness. There's that force that is, we can call it God, we can call it the Creator, but that force that desires to bestow goodness. And the creation, humanity, is only one thing, desire to receive. Right? We can call sometimes we refer to it as a vessel. But basically, you understand that that the, the foundational uh, creation is only two things. Well, the first of the force that wasn't created, that was ever present, the desire to share, which is we call the light of the creator, or the endless light of the creator. And then there is creation called the vessel or the desire to receive. And that's really all that we are. When we speak about our soul, for example, what is our soul? Our soul is our desire. So I think it's really important to have a true appreciation for the, the, the grand nature of desire. And therefore, it is what causes either the greatest benefit in life or the greatest pain in life. 